so today is Sunday and it's the day off for all the um, maids that work, all the nannies that work in Hong Kong. So you see a lot of them hanging around. They're always like the Filipino maids um, that the families hire. So it's pretty crowded today. It's also Christmas Eve, so that's probably why. Just a fool for love. I still have hope for us. Don't you go, don't you go, wasting your time. I can't let, I can't let you out my mind. I'm just a What's up guys? Um, it is currently 6.30 p.m. and at 8 o'clock there's gonna be fireworks on the harbor. So there's a lot, a lot of people around. Super crowded around here. I managed to find like a decent spot by the water. I'm pretty low on batteries too. So I'm gonna try to preserve as much as I can so I can film some of the uh, fireworks tonight. Uh, so yeah, see you guys. Don't you go, don't you go wasting your time. I can't let, I can't let you out my mind. All right, as you can probably tell from the footage, it took a huge L. <laughs> Couldn't even see anything, but good thing is fireworks are three nights in a row. So hopefully, hopefully I get to see you tomorrow. 
but fingers crossed. Good morning, guys. It is currently 11 a.m. in Hong Kong, and uh, it's actually Christmas today. As you can see from my little hat, I bought this in Japan for like four bucks at the Don Quixote. I'm mostly gonna be walking around the markets today, so less of the malls and expensive like luxury, luxury stores. So yeah, Merry Christmas, everybody. Sing Dan Zi, bye long. floor of wherever this building is. Okay. One, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine. Somewhere up there. It's my dad's old high school, St. Xavier. a decent spot. It's promising. T minus two hours until the fireworks.
afraid of falling down Fire started right behind me If I don't drown now I fear that I can't fade the burning I can't hear a sound Nothing that I say Definitely a lot more successful than yesterday. Morning guys. It is currently Boxing Day, um, 10 a.m. right now. Just basically woke up. I am super tired from all the walking, super busy. I've been out and about. My knees are really tired from standing all day. So I thought today I'd start off the morning um, a little different. Since I am in Hong Kong, I want to go to somewhere more in line with my Chinese history and do something more traditional and visit something you know different than what I normally see. So I'm going to do something interesting this morning. Um, hope you all look forward to it. Hey, what's up guys? I'm currently in line at the mall for a Jujutsu Kaisen exhibition. I signed up for this yesterday and you're supposed to be the first 30 people in line to get a special Gojo card. So I made sure to show up early. I'm like number 22 right now. It doesn't open for another 45 minutes. Super smoky here. Everywhere smells like incense. Heaven must have sent you from the stars above. Heaven must have sent. 
Shopping, got him wildin', tweaking out on commas and my veins, the molly throbbing. Rich as hell still robbing, ain't no love the way I'm rocking. Bentley color goblin, forest green and lane, I'm hogging. Wrap the pee like swallowing, get it through your fucking noggin. Damn, money's first, I'm always died in. Uh, money's first, I'm always died in, is that a problem? I made M's off of TV like I work for Viacom. Doggy didn't stay for long, he left when the sirens rung. Flies, niggas, we turn bitches to BDs in the tires. Dabbers, I could put out wildfires. The house behind barbed wire. 25, but living like I'm 50 with three kids. All these bitches in my bitch. 500,000 on my bitch. Uh. Fuck if you don't like me. I'ma still get fatty more than likely. It's enticing. Hey, right, what's up, guys? In a bit, I'm actually gonna play some volleyball. I signed up for a volleyball organized meetup session. For now, I'm gonna chill for a bit and then I'll head over. Peace.
night, so it is currently 10.30 p.m. Just got back from volleyball. So much fun. Met a lot of people, some really nice people, and they're all like pretty damn good at volleyball too. So it was like good play. I uh, got a couple of good hits in, as you can probably tell. Hopefully you guys will see the replays. Yeah, just had dinner with a guy I met uh, from the volleyball. He's a super nice guy. And yeah, I don't know. This is like my first friends that I've made on this trip and feels good. I guess. I don't know how to say it. Feels wholesome. Uh, yeah. Not much else to say. Bye. almost 5 p.m. I'm super tired. My feet are hurting uh, from standing and walking all day. I got invited to play beach volleyball uh, with one of the guys that I met um, yesterday. That's gonna be later tonight and then we're gonna go grab dinner before it. Um, so that'll be super fun. Hopefully my legs don't die. I'm gonna chill for now. Maybe just take a little nap and then stretch and then um, head out in about 45 minutes-ish. So. Uh, yeah, see you guys.
you also played volleyball? <laughs> uh, give, give me a name. What's up, guys? It is currently 1 a.m. Uh, so I just got back from volleyball. Um, super fun. Again, met a bunch of really nice people, very welcoming. The beach volleyball place that we went to is really nice. Uh, we played a bunch of two on two and three on three. One of the guys, uh, the guy that invited me today, he invited me to go watch um, some volleyball tomorrow. It's gonna be some high school tournament. There'll be all the top like high schools in Hong Kong competing against each other at night. For tomorrow i'm gonna be playing more volleyball actually it's gonna be a different meetup so hopefully it's gonna be um, pretty fun it's actually been really enjoyable uh these past few days because i've been actually able to play volleyball for one and then also uh, meet and connect with like people in hong kong uh, they're all super nice so uh that's that uh, i'll see you guys tomorrow good night Morning. That's so funny. Yeah. Uh... <laughs>
Good morning guys. Okay, so today we are actually going to Macau. Um, I have all my um, tickets booked already. Um, so my departure from the ferry terminal is at 7.30 a.m. So today is also the 29th, which is uh, my birthday. So I'm officially uh, 26 years old. So starting to inch forward in my uh, later 20s now, getting, getting a little old. place up here, I'm using a straw. Uh, this place up here, my dad used to live here. Uh, this is the house that he originally grew up in until he was like three years old, I think. Um, yeah. casino now and uh, since it's my birthday I'm just gonna toss in like a hundred Hong Kong dollars which is like 16 bucks Guys, I went big, got myself uh, 50 Hong Kong dollars. Buy myself a, an eighth of a lollipop with this kind of money. All right, what's up guys? It is almost 12 o'clock, almost midnight. I had a really good dinner with uh, one of my friends and we ended up talking for like a couple hours at the restaurant. I'm planning on going to Lan Kwai Fong right now, which is also LKF. Uh, it's like the uh, nightlife area for Hong Kong. Uh, it's one of the areas I haven't checked out yet, and it's on my list, so I uh, thought I'd check it out tonight since it's Friday and uh, see what it's like. Either way, I got a pack for tomorrow, and then um, that'll conclude my Hong Kong portion of the trip. Yeah, we'll see what tonight's like. I'm officially trolling. I am. I uh, I started off here, and I was supposed to go up here, but it's somehow, I ended up going on the wrong tram, 
I guess I turned it the wrong way and then I'll, I'm all the way down here now. Good start to the night. Cause I suis dans le secteur Hier tu m'attendais là La finissant des buzz Pack dans la street C'est la même tous les prix Descends maintenant Viens on fuck maintenant Cause I suis dans le secteur Hier tu m'attendais là La finissant des buzz What's up guys, it is 6 a.m. and I'm now just getting back home. I am completely exhausted and I need to sleep because I gotta check out for tomorrow morning. I haven't even packed so um, needless to say the night was fun so uh yeah talk to you guys later all right i am now showered and um about to go to bed i realize i've actually been up for 24 hours now today because i had to wake up at 6 30 to go to macau and then now it's 6 30 um in the morning again so i'm gonna have to get some sleep tonight <sighs> okay good night guys You're the bun me. All right, what's up guys? Um, I'm fully packed now and I'm just gonna eat lunch. I gotta check out in like 25 minutes and then I'll just head straight to the airport. I'm still pretty tired from last night. Basically, the short version of yesterday was that I had arrived to LKF around 11.30 maybe. It was a lot busier than I expected. The streets were packed. I was walking around this huge loop that you can do, looking at the different clubs, and I started feeling like pretty nervous, a bit of a social anxiety, uh, because I didn't really know anyone, and there's lots of people like partying, like all drunk, and uh, really loud music everywhere. Everyone's all dressed up and stuff. I was gonna do one big circle to see what all the clubs look like, and then I would have just walked into a club, and go in for a bit, and then leave. At the end of my loop, actually, I ended up bumping into one of the guys that I met from volleyball two days ago at the beach volleyball and he's like yo what's up man and I was like oh like it's my first time here I don't really know anyone I don't really know what to do but I thought I'd just come out because I'm flying out tomorrow and he's like yo let me show you around like just come with us he's with his like international school friends like high school friends that they've all come back for a big reunion so we stand outside for like three hours trying to find somewhere to go that's like a whole different story. Eventually, it's just me and him, and we try to go into a bunch of clubs. We go into one like super bad one, um, and then eventually find our way to like a pretty decent one where we met some other people, and then ended up staying for way too long. It was like 5 a.m. that we stayed until, and then we grabbed some food, and then we made our way home, so. It's crazy. The night would have been very different if I didn't run into that guy. He ended up making it a really good time, and then had a lot of fun. Didn't even drink that much, but, uh, the music was good, the company was good, and then was able to have a memorable experience in uh, Hong Kong for the nightlife before I left. So pretty appreciative of uh, the people that I met so far. Everyone's super welcoming in Hong Kong. Yeah, I'll def definitely be back and I'm happy that I have people that I know for the next time that I come back. So next up is Taipei. I'm going to be staying at Vincent's mom's apartment, just north of the main Taipei area. And I'm just gonna be there for a few days for New Year's. I'm gonna take it a lot slower. Past few weeks have been super packed for the Taipei portion of it. I'm just gonna ease out of it, um, relax. But I do wanna see the um, fireworks at New Year's Eve. So that's the only, I guess, busy thing I'll be doing. So yeah, that's all. I'll be flying out in a bit. And I'm just gonna eat my food and check out and then go to the airport. All right. <laughs> Alright, 
so I just ate at a Taiwanese beef noodle place that's right around the corner from Vincent's apartment. This is actually the place that we went to on our very last meal before we flew out last time we were here in Taiwan. Uh, so it brings a lot of memories because it used to be super run down and it looks sort of messy in there but they renovated it and it looks much better now so it's pretty cool to see how much has changed since uh, we were last here so i was looking at old photos of when we were here before and i realized when the boys and i were here it was back in april of 2019 so four and a half years later uh back again i uh, didn't realize it's been that long so pretty cool one of my favorite things about 7-Eleven is the fact that the ones here actually have like green milk teas and jasmine green milk teas. In Japan, only the family where it has it. And the Hong Kong didn't even have any, so yeah.